Hi everybody, today we're going to take a look at this Wi-Fi camera. The model on the box is ZC-M8. Let's take a closer look at the box. It says it has Wi-Fi, one-click photo recording, 180-degree rotation, one-key camera audio synchronization, automatic light filling for night shooting. Recording video recording. Rotary lens back clip design, infrared night, vision HD shooting, three infrared LEDs. This just repeats it on the back. On the other side, it says Wi Fi 1080p HD, three meter super strong night vision, auto save, audio and video synchronization, 128 gigabyte uh, SD card capable, one click photo recording, 180 degree rotation, and made in China. Let's open it up. So what you get. A little bit of instructions. You get USB-C cable with it. There's the camera. There it is. Difficult to see what's going on here. There's a little clip, the infrared lights. This is how you turn on the infrared, the power, mic, a micro SD card, and this little circle is the magnet. And this uh, flips around so you can position the camera the way you want. And I didn't test that little magnet, I test it on the fridge right behind me. And oh, it's just sliding down. It's very weak. It's a very weak uh, magnet. So I actually I opened this up and I already used it, and then I reboxed it for this video. So what you're supposed to do is uh, open up this uh, manual. The other side's Chinese, and you scan the QR code. It takes you to the app to download the app. So. The app that you get is V720, and it's unbelievable that you get advertisements here uh, with this within this app while you're trying to use it. So I press skip. Uh, apparently, I didn't press skip exactly. So it opens up the ad. There's further app. It further has more ads in here. So you got to watch out how you click, or else uh, it will. Um, It'll take you to the ad. So I'm going to power up the camera. It has a blue light here. At first you have to hold it down to connect it to the Wi-Fi, which I did. And you just follow the step-by-step uh, uh, -step instructions. Surprisingly, I just I had it on charge. Uh, I guess it's not fully charged. But the weird thing is when I do fully charge and the light goes off when it's fully charged, you turn it on and it indicates here that it's at 80%. So as soon as you turn it on, it says it's at 80%. Anyway, so let's see. So you press the play button. It'll connect it. Right now I'm using, it's on the LTE uh, mobile. And let's see what we got. Okay, there's the camera. So you can go to the record. Search recording, press pause, all right, uh, and then you can do a picture, make some noise, and if you go to uh, playback, or you go back actually, go to albums, and then you got your album for your picture, and you got your album for your video, there's my cat in the backyard. Actually, that seven-second video that I just took. Oh, here it is. And it's got sound. My cat heard me. He wants to go outside. So you can go to the record. Search recording. So there you go. It records a video and sound. So the weird thing is, I went outside for a walk and I clipped it on myself and um, it only records for like five minutes and then it stops 
So I tested again while having the app and the, on the phone open and it still did the same thing. It just only records up to five minutes for whatever reason. So on the uh, Amazon app, it said that, uh, or the ad for the Amazon app, here it is. I got it in Canada. It was 24.22 Canadian. The brand says Goshida. It doesn't say anything about Goshida on the box. And uh, if we go further down, here are the specs. 1080p, Android, infrared, night vision, which does seem to work okay. I did try it last night uh, within the home wide angle. And what else? That's about it. Oh, it's got uh, some nice ads here. Mini body video. So anyways, I wasn't too happy with this clip. I clipped it on to my jacket. It's kind of uh, shallow. It would have been better if it was longer. So that way, you know, it doesn't fly off. I tried to do it on my belt, but then it would start, you know, as you're walking, it would start creeping up. You feel like it's going to fall off of the belt. So I didn't like that. And one-click recording, I don't know about that. Like, that is the actual, the light vision. So uh, it's for the night vision. It's not for one-click recording. So, I mean, I can test it right now. Again. Oh, wait, I have to look at this ad first before I can use my camera. Connecting. Now it's slow to connect. Oh, pressing play. Like, this app is just ridiculous. You're counting on this. Okay, so now it's connecting to the camera. 30, 40, 50. Look how slow this is. Ridiculous. Okay, so now I'm going to push the button. And does it activate? No, it activates the night vision. It doesn't activate recording. What happens if you push the power button? Absolutely nothing. It doesn't start recording. So you have to use the app to start recording. And I wouldn't even trust the button even if it worked. Like you don't know if it's on or not. So let's see what else can we talk about this thing. Right, let's go back to the Amazon advertisement for it. One click recording, it doesn't do that. Phone, wireless, remote, the app is obviously ridiculous. Portable sports clip, like I said, it's too short. It'll, you know, just fall off on you. Um, no lag, no delay, that's not true. It seems to be very laggy and delayed. So, there you have it. I'm basically unhappy with it, and I'm going to be returning it. There you go. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe.